Um, you said that it is possible that we will have superintelligence in a few thousand days yeah. from now. Two years ago, did you think that? And when you say a few thousand days, I can do various versions of math on what that means. I think it's possible, uh, and I think it's possible not super far in the future. I expect that in 2025, we will have systems that people look at, even people who are skeptical of current progress, and say, wow, that, I did not expect that. That does change what. Like what? Um, agents are the thing everyone is talking about, I think for good reason. You know, this idea that you can give an AI system a pretty complicated task, like a kind of task you'd give to a very smart human that takes a while to go off and do and use a bunch of tools and create something of value. Um, that's the kind of thing I'd expect right. next year. And that's like a huge deal. We talk about that like, oh, you know, this thing is going to happen. But that's like, that, if that works as well as we hope it does, that can, that can really transform things. Okay, so what are we supposed to think? There's been a whole bunch of headlines in the past couple of weeks where people have talked actually about maybe that the scaling laws of AI actually are slowing down. And you put out this, I don't know if it was cryptic or it was very direct. You put out a tweet where you wrote, there is no wall. I don't see how it could be any less cryptic than that. <laughs> like, that was an attempt not to be cryptic at all and say, hey, this is going to keep going. In fact, 